Wait a minute. Hey, are you the new guy who knocked on Franco? Yes, why? Because now I have to take over his job. You did a great job. Thanks a lot. And what's it like leading the hunters? Leave me alone. Ah, who have we here then? Looky, looky. There you are. I've got good news and bad news for you. First, tell me the bad news. Raven is looking for you. So are his guards. Actually, all the bandits are looking for you. And if they find you, they'll kill you. A lot of people have already tried that. Then your combat skills are as good as your craftiness. Coming into the camp with some of our armor is like the sheep coming to the wolves. Your life is hanging by a thin thread, son of danger. And what's the good news? Well, I don't really know why, but you've made yourself a couple of powerful enemies. You can count yourself lucky that I recognized you and no one else, because I am understanding and sociable. How much do you want? Oh, no, please. I don't want to extort gold from you. I wouldn't dream of it. Then what do you want? Recently, somebody tried to get Esteban out of the way, but he went into the bodyguards. Go to Esteban and talk to him. Afterwards, we'll talk again. Hi. What you want? Where do I get a pickaxe? Go to Huno the Smith. But even if you have a pick, that don't mean that you can get into the mine. If you want to get in, you have to talk to Esteban. Don't even bother going to Thoris. He'll only let you in if you have a red stone. Tell me, what do you think of Esteban? Hey, he's the boss here. He's all right, I think. He always lets the good boys into the mine, the ones who know something about mining, I mean. And you know something about mining? <laughs> I'm the best. What do I have to know about mining gold? Well, there's something you should know. Gold is an ore. There's one damn important difference. I mean, what woman would hang a chain of ore around her neck? <laughs> when picking, work from top to bottom. You can work the nuggets loose best that way. There are also diggers who do it the other way around, but eh, it's far more difficult. You look like a digger. I am a digger. The last time I was in the mine, I worked my ass off. What happens to the gold from the mine? Thoris collects it and then distributes it. No one is allowed to keep what he mines. Everybody gets only a part of the gold. That way even the hunters and guards get their share. I think that's okay. Since we've had that rule, there have been fewer deaths and, and the miners still get more than the guys who hang around outside. Why aren't you in the mine now? I was in the mine long enough and slaved away until I was about to fall over. Now I need a few days rest. <sighs> Before I get my next red stone. What's the deal with these red stones? Eh, that's something Thoris and Esteban thought of. Thoris takes care of the gold distribution and Esteban organizes the workers for the mine. Of course, he doesn't want to run to Thoris every time he sends someone to the mine. That's why he gives us one of those red stone tablets and Thoris lets us in then. It's like a pass. Don't wake him. What? If you want to do yourself a favor, then stay away from Skinner. The fellow is unpredictable. He killed the last guy who woke him up. Let him sleep for everybody's sake. Are you a digger? Because of the pads? 
Nah, I just wear them because they're comfortable. All I do here is cook meat stew. Here, you can try some. It'll make you strong. It's always important to train your strength. There are many dangers lurking out there. If you want, I can help you to get stronger. Uh, damn it. What's up? Why did you wake me, eh? I, I bet you don't even know. No, don't say anything. It's too late for excuses. Now you have two choices. You can fight me and my Betty, or you can try to run away. In your place, I'd run. Finish him. Let him have it. Watch Show him who's boss. Show him! Get him boy! Show him! Don't Idiot. stop now! Let him have Hang it! Hang on! Shit! What you waiting for? Let him have it! Don't Idiot. stop now! Hang Show on! Him boy. Hang Hang on. Don't Get stop him, now! Show yeah. him! Let him have it! Nothing to plunder. Hi. Hi, I'm Lenar. Welcome to the Diggers' camp. Diggers? I thought this was the bandits' camp. Right, but the bandits are only here to dig. So... Can you teach me anything about gold mining? Certainly, but if I teach you something, you'll be able to mine more gold. That's why I'm asking. Sure, but if you can mine more, it's only fair I get a share of it. Well... You might as well give him a share in advance. Well, let's say... 50 gold pieces. Teach me something about gold mining. Good. Regular swings will take you forward. Don't overdo it. But also, don't fall asleep swinging. And don't always strike at the same spot. Try to work around a good size nugget. Do that and you're on the way to becoming a master digger. A dark cloud over the house. The one approaches with blood. Needed to call him. He who sees me, he sees me. Oh no, go away, be gone. Are you all right? Green, green novice. I cannot find it. Here, take this swamp weed. Not green, not strong, not green, not strong. How can I help you? The green, the green novice will help the novice. It looks like you're a master of your craft. I've heard that before. Did you bring the steel? Steel? No, I think you're confusing me with... Hmm, somehow you seem familiar. Do we know each other from somewhere? Sure, from the old camp. The old camp, right! You're that curious guy! I thought you was dead! Yes, everybody thinks that. Who else survived? A few. Some fled with Raven like I did. 
from a lot of others, the old camp became a grave. Tell me about your escape. Chaos broke out the day the barrier fell. Some hid, others fled, and there was a plundering everywhere. What did you do? I was about to leave the camp when it turned bright very suddenly, and a scorching pain ate through my skin. I'd been struck by damn lightning. It feels like I can still hear it. Later, someone told me that Thoris found me and took me with him. I need better armor. So? You can have this. It's Esteban's fault. It's so expensive. That damn dog pockets his share of every piece of armor I sell. Show me what you have. Hey, do you deal in smithy equipment? Huno has steel. I only have a few lumps of ore, but I won't give that up. It's the only thing I have of value. Do you work for Huno? I wanted to make up a bit of gold and took up with Huno. But since then, Esteban hasn't given me anything at all. He said he can't use me anymore. What else can I do but continue to slave away for Huno? Everything else all right with you? I just want to do my job, man. You know the rule. No one goes into the mine without a redstone tablet. Forget the mine. I have to see Raven. Even then, we have rules here and they apply to everyone, even to you. Go back. If you try to enter the upper square without permission, the other guards will kill you. Those are the rules. If you have a problem with that, go talk to Esteban. He's responsible for the camp. Wait a minute. It's important that I get to Raven. Oh yeah? Do you really think you can make it through to him? His guards have orders not to let anyone in. You'd be dead before you even saw him. So knock that idea out of your head. Don't you remember me from the old camp? You were one of the prisoners. Maybe you were one of my guards. And? Does that make us allies now? No, it doesn't. Maybe you're the guy who brought down the barrier. Maybe you also killed my pals. So what? Those times are over. You want in? Then get yourself a red stone and don't waste my time. Come on, let me in, for old time's sake. 
Let me explain something to you. Do you know why I'm still alive? Because I've always been loyal to my people. I don't have to agree with everything Raven does, but I'll stick to the rules, and so will you. I have a stone tablet for you here. You don't have the right stone. Only the red ones are important. Hey, what's with your armor? Where can I get armor like that? You can't. This armor is reserved for Raven's Guard. I hardly think there's an entrance exam for new candidates. But the ultimate decision isn't mine, it's Raven's. I won't be treated like that. Tell me that isn't true. As if I didn't have enough problems. I'll never get this open without the right key. I've got no time for things like that. You have to feel sorry for the poor guy. That isn't true. As if I didn't have to That's no secret. Hey! Hey! So you're the fellow who fought his way into camp, huh? That got around fast. Franco was a tough nut. No one messed with him. No one, except you. Just to make it clear, if you try the same shit with me, <laughs> I'll kill you. I want to get into the mine. Of course you do. Then you're in the right place with me because everyone who digs in the mine gets to keep a hefty share of the gold. And I hand out the red stones you need so that Thoris will let you in. Give me one of those red stones. Okay, but they aren't free. Normally I uh, demand a share of the gold the boys get for digging. <laughs> How much do you know about mining gold, huh? You probably learned a few tricks, right? If I give you a red stone, it won't be because you're such a great digger. No. I have another job for you. I need better armor. Why? You already have some. That's good enough for you now. What sort of job? One of the bandits planned to kill me. But instead, my guards killed him. He was hot for your job, huh? Ah, he was an idiot. A thug without a brain. He never would have got the idea to attack me on his own. Nah. He was only fulfilling a contract. Someone else sent him. So, I'm supposed to find out who was behind it? Whoever sent me this assassin will pay for it. Find him, and I'll let you into the mine. Senyan sent me to you about this business. Senyan? He also works for me. 
I told him he should keep his eyes open. How should I go about it? Everyone here in the camp knows about it. So you're playing with all your cards on the table, huh? Try to find out who's on my side and who isn't. And don't let the boys make a fool of you. Talk to Snaff. That fat cook picks up a lot. He simply needs to practice more. That's nothing new. Nobody wants to know. You have to feel sorry. Hey, you! Hey, if you're looking for a decent trader here in the camp, then you just found him. My hut is right behind Esteban, so if you need anything, come on by. Wait a minute. I'm staying out. What do you know about the attempt on Esteban's life? Listen, I don't want anything to do with that business. Got it? I have my own worries. I'm a victim myself. In what way? I paid a lot of gold for my last delivery, but it never came. Some swine made off with it. I've been robbed! Probably by some of our own people. What sort of delivery? A packet of lockpicks. Someone was supposed to get them from the pirates for me, but a guy named Juan snatched it away from me, including the gold that I paid for it. That bastard is hiding somewhere in the swamp. Watch out who you tell Juan. Juan worked for Esteban. What? Don't play games with me. You knew about it. Fine, you're right. But I hope you also realize why I didn't tell you about it. Everyone in the camp knows you work for Esteban. I don't have any desire to get dragged into this business just because you're hot for a red stone. Wants to know. I don't believe you. Believe what you want, but I'm warning you, if you're planning on telling Esteban some fairy tale about me, you're next. Why haven't I, I have your package. Indeed. What about Juan? He's dead. Good. Then he can't cause me any more trouble. As far as you are concerned, I have a pretty good relationship with Huno. I'll see to it that you get your armor cheap from now on. And here, I once got this stone from Caristo. It's the only thing that survived my flight from the barrier. I think you'll have more use for it than I do. One hand washes the other. That hasn't changed since back then. Show me your wares. About the attack on Esteban. Uh, yeah? Do you have any idea who's behind this? Why do you want to know? Esteban wants to see him dead. Oh, you work for the boss. Then I'll tell you what I know. When the attack took place, I was trying to get my pickaxe from Huna the Smith. But he wasn't there. And? Usually he's always there. Very suspicious if you ask me. About the attack on Esteban. Yeah. Do you have any idea who was behind it? Sure. Let me tell you, I bet that Emilio is behind this. He always ran to the mine like a crazy man. He dug as much as he could. But since the attack, he's been sitting on his bench, not budging an inch. It's obvious. To get into the mine, he has to have a red stone from Esteban. I bet he doesn't dare look him in the eye. What would Emilio get out of Esteban's death? What do I know? Maybe he has a pal in the mine who would take over Esteban's place then. Yeah, that would make sense.
What do you know about the attack? Hey, man. I didn't have anything to do with it. Lenar told me a bit about you. Lenar? That guy's an idiot. You must have noticed. He said you haven't been in the mine since the attack happened. I don't know anything. You are working together with that Senyan. <laughs> You're in cahoots with Esteban. I heard exactly what you were blabbing about. Up to now, Esteban hasn't given a damn about us. Why should I trust his people? Leave me alone! Hey! I've talked to Esteban. And did he tell you about the attack? He ordered me to find out who sent the assassin. Do you know anything about that? No more than you do. I'm also on the hunt for the guy behind it. And now we come to the interesting part. Let's hear it. I want you to do your job well. I want you to find the traitor, and when you have found him, I want you to kill him for me. Then I will pocket the reward. I have your wanted poster. Don't forget that. Do your job and do it well. You can figure out what will happen otherwise. Forget it. Then what do I still need you for, you bum? Hey, people! Look who we have here! Tell me, why did Senyan yell, look who we have here? Unpaid debts. Do you have a problem with that? <laughs> no, man. I don't have a problem with it. Quite the opposite. The bastard worked for Esteban. Help me find out who was behind the attack. No, I don't want anything to do with it. If an idiot like Lenar notices that you're behaving oddly, it won't take long before Esteban finds out too. I... Shit. I'll tell you one name. Nothing more. I'm listening. Huno. Go to Huno. He must know something about this business. What do you have against Esteban? All that swine thinks about is money. Every few days one of us gets eaten by a crawler. But Esteban just won't send any fighters into the mine. And why? Those guys belong to Raven's bodyguards, and Esteban is scared shitless to tell them. <laughs> He'd rather let us get killed. Do you want to eat or chatter? What'll it be? What's on the menu? I want to try out a new dish. Fire strips and hammer sauce. Fire strips? Crisp, delicately roasted meat mixed with pickled fireweed. But don't worry, I already have the ingredients for that. Hammer sauce? A sauce made from hammer hard booze. I have a recipe from a guy called Lou. You get the ingredients and distill the booze up on the alchemist's bench. Then I'll make a sauce out of it. What do you think? Okay, I'll do it. All right, here's the recipe. What do you know about the attack? The thing with Esteban? You know how it is. The barkeeper hears everything, but never takes sides. So do you know something? I didn't say that. If you were in my place, what would you do? I would think about what I know about the guy behind it. First, it was probably one of the bandits. That means he's here in the camp. Second, that he's here in the camp means that he is watching you. Third, as long as he thinks that you're on Esteban's side, he'll never reveal himself to you. So, the interesting question is, what are your chances of finding your man? What do people here think of Esteban? You'll have to be a bit more precise. Each piece of information will cost you... How much? Ten gold pieces. What are my chances of finding my man? Hmm. 
you bumped off one of Estevan's people, the man you're looking for will believe you're on his side. But he won't just reveal himself to you. You'll have to find out more. Thanks. Hey, I didn't tell you anything you didn't already know. Got it? What do you think of Esteban? Whoever talks about him is soon dead. How's it going with you? Well, at least I'm in now. Lucia brews some wicked liquor, but Esteban won't let me into the mine. At any rate, not yet. He's given me another job. And? What does he want from you? There was an attempt on Esteban's life. He wants to know who's behind it. Esteban thinks that Snaff is involved. I'm supposed to keep an eye on him. What do you know about the attempt on Esteban's life? You're looking for the guy who's behind it, huh? But I don't know anything about it. How could I? I was still in the swamp, then... I'll come back later. Hey! Aren't you from Corinus? Don't remind me. My life in that city was horrible. While the ships with the new convicts kept coming in, there was still life in the town. But all those other guys? <laughs> no thanks. Maybe it's because we're on an island. Well, those days are over. I'm finished with Eldritch. Why? He's a wimp. When the bandits dragged me off, he didn't lift a finger to help me. What are you planning to do? We'll see. For now, I'll stay here with Snaff, Fisk, and the others. Have you already talked to Thoris? Oh, Enos, is that a hunk of a man? <laughs> Excuse me. Let's get back to your question. I haven't set a goal. I'm only drifting. And? How's it going? Listen, if you want something to eat, go to Snaff. If you want something to drink, you're in the right place. Well, what do you drink here, then? We only have a little beer. The only beer on the island was brought by the Paladines. Just about the only good thing those fellows brought with them. Otherwise, we drink booze. I got moonshine, grog, and white rum. Mmm, you should try that. I got the recipe from Samuel. The old boy really knows his trade. You're not very fond of the paladins, are you? Those fanatical murderers in the pay of the fire magicians? No, but Lord Hagen occupies the city with his thugs, and everybody bows down to him. And I didn't want to do that. I wasn't going to wait until they closed down the Red Lantern and locked me up. The Paladins are the warriors of Innes. They aren't murderers. So? Blood sticks to their swords, too. Just like the weapons of the pirates or the bandits. The only difference is they do it in Innos's name and not because they want to survive. The Paladins don't only fight in his name. Innos chooses his warriors. So? I believe it's the people themselves who choose. Still, your words amaze me. You talk almost like you were one of them. Have you ever killed someone? No, and I'm very glad of it. Please, let's not be so serious anymore. Instead, let's drink and enjoy every moment the gods give us. Can you teach me something? <laughs> Only too gladly. You can train your dexterity with me. What do you know about the attempt on Esteban's life? Nothing at all. Give me something to drink.
Hey, you! I want to become more dexterous. Hey, you! Hey, you! Green, green novice, I cannot find it. Here, take this green novice. What is wrong? So tell me what is wrong with you. Once, I belonged to the Brotherhood of the Sleeper. Everything was all right back then. Fine. We were all condemned criminals. But for us novices, life was free from care. Hey, I was a prisoner in the Valley of Mines myself. Tell me something new. I... I don't remember anything. Darkness lies across my mind. Come on, concentrate. What happened? When did you come back to your senses? Raven. I only remember Raven and... and dark rooms. What about Raven? What did he do to you? I'm sorry. It's as though my mind were held prisoner. I don't understand it myself. There must be a way to refresh your memory. Yes. Yes, maybe there is a way. The gurus knew of various forms of altering the spirit and the will. Do you remember anything about that? No. I'm afraid this knowledge vanished with the gurus. Damn. Well, if there is a way to free your spirit, I'll find it. Do you need more swamp weed? Yes, definitely. I will buy all the swamp weed you can get your hands on. I'll even pay you more for it than Fisk. About the attack on Esteban. What do you want from me? I'm looking for the person behind the attack. And why are you coming to me about that? I thought you might know something about that business. I don't know anything. No idea, you I've heard a few things about you. So? I heard that you weren't in your place when the attack occurred. What else? Emilio spat out your name. You definitely know something about the attack. You've been having a chat with old Emilio, eh? And he isn't the only one who suspects you. What's that supposed to mean, huh? That's exactly what I said. I want to join forces with the assassin. Against Esteban, really? Then prove it. I've been waiting for too long for a delivery of steel from the pirates. I suspect that Esteban captured it in order to sell it to me later at a higher price. Of course, he won't do that himself. A couple of bandits in the swamp are on his payroll. How do you know that? Drunken bandits talk too much. Does this talkative bandit have a name? His name is none of your business, but the guy you're looking for is called Juan. Anyway, I haven't seen him in the camp for a long time. You'll have to look for him in the swamp. Okay, I'll do it for you. Good. We'll see if you can be trusted. I have the steel. And? Was Juan there too? He was. 
I knew it. That rat Esteban was behind it. Now, what about our agreement? The man you want to talk to is waiting for you in the bar. Talk to the barkeeper. Kuno sent me. Looks like you found your man. Go on up to the next floor. Someone's waiting for you. I distilled the booze. Excellent. Then I'll finish it. Here, you can try a portion right away. That'll put some strength in your arm. Oh, and if I can help you again, for you all information is free from now on. So you were behind the attack? Yes. Esteban is in the way of my business. He won't let any of the bandits who work for me into the mine. He's making sure that everyone works for him, and only for him. That way, he can pocket a percentage of every deal and control the whole camp. Do you want to take his place? I'm a traitor. I just want to go about my business in peace. What are you planning? We'll get Esteban out of the way. That means you will kill him and take his place. As long as his bodyguards are with him, I don't have a chance. Then we'll have to get them to leave by telling the truth. What truth? You have done your job. You know that I was behind the attack. Tell Esteban, and he'll send his boys to kill me. I'll expect them here. When they're gone, you can deal with the bastard, and I'll take care of the guards. About the assignment. Listen, I have other things I have to take care of. I thought you might be interested in knowing who was behind the attack. Who is it? Tell me his name so my guards can wring his neck. The traitor Fisk is behind it. At the moment, he's sitting in the bar unsuspecting and drinking. Ha! Well done, kid. My guards will take care of him. You heard him, boys! Go get Fisk! I couldn't care less. And what happens next? What happens next? I'll tell you what happens. Fisk will die a painful death, and everyone in the camp will find out about it. That'll be a warning to all of them. Do I get a red stone now? Yeah, you did your job well. Someone like you has no business in the mine. I can use you much better out here. You'll stay in the camp and continue working for me. Are you trying to play me for a fool? There was never a question of me working for you. It isn't everyone who gets an offer like this, but if you don't want it, you're free to leave the camp. How about if you keep your word and give me a red stone? Hey, one more word. My guards will have to hurt you too. What guards? What? Oh, I see. You're trying to pull a fast one. Just you wait. See? That was... That was no big deal. You already know what I think. Esteban is finished. I've waited for this for a long time. I think you've got things to do now, and uh, I need to go back to my business. So, if you need anything else, you know where to find me.
nothing to plunder. I could tell you. Anything's possible. Hey! I have a redstone tablet here. Okay. You killed Esteban. So you will do his job now. They have a few problems with mine crawlers in the mine. Three diggers have bought it already. It's your job to provide replacements. And when can I finally get into the damned mine? Do your job. Afterwards you can do what you want. <laughs> 